The world wasn't created for people with disabilities. It's an able-bodied world, so it doesn't surprise me that there's not a lot of innovation in the disability space. At Imaginable Solutions, that's our mission, to not only create assistive technology, but to be advocates for the disability community, to allow people to express themselves, be independent, be creative, to release their full potential. Limited hand mobility is a global problem, affecting 58 million children and adults who have a medical condition or injury that impairs their hand mobility. Our international award-winning product is Guided Hands, an assistive device that uses a sliding system that promotes controlled and guided hand movements as the individual holds a handpiece tailored to their level of hand mobility. I created the first prototype of Guided Hands for my friend, Alyssa. She had cerebral palsy and she loved to paint, but as her condition progressed, she wasn't able to hold on to a paintbrush anymore. I actually created it for her to help her reignite her passion for painting. The first prototype was made out of pipe cleaners, straws, and a sponge. I included Alyssa throughout the entire design process. And one thing that I really learned was being able to sit down beside the person you're designing for, put your hand in theirs and feel the spasticity in their hand and be able to create something that can truly meet their needs. And the only way to do that is that personal human connection. I met a young man named Miles. He had autism and he used guided hands to communicate independently for the first time. And the first thing he typed with guided hands is, don't treat me like a baby. I'm very smart. I just have a very tough time communicating that. A lot of these people, they, they don't have a voice and they're not heard in our society. And Imaginable Solutions is not all about just creating technology, but it's being their voice and advocating for people who can't advocate for themselves. Guided Hands has changed the lives of over 5,750 people across the world. It's being used every day in schools, hospitals, nursing homes, and occupational therapy. And it not only impacts the individual with the disability, but it also impacts their caregivers and their families. Starting from very humble beginnings to pipe cleaner straws and a sponge as a prototype to manufacturing in my basement with my mom to now having a manufacturing facility here in Hamilton, Ontario with 20 3D printers and now a team of seven. It's been an absolute whirlwind to see the progress that we've made and I get goosebumps every single time someone uses the device and thinking to myself, I created that. Self-expression is a human right, one that should be accessible for everyone. And at Imaginable Solutions, we're enabling people to live the lives that they imagine and make the world more accessible.